happy Saturday and happy Vlogmas day 11. Today we are going to be baking again. Uh, yes, last weekend was my mom's family recipe. This weekend it's going to be a couple of my dad's family recipes. So, you ready? To eat? <laughs> we have to bake first. Warm cookies. <laughs> All right, let's get started with the day. Okay, the dough is all mixed up and up next is the filling. So these are a date filled cookie that, um, and my dad is not a big cookie fan or sweets type of person, dessert person, but these were one of the very few cookies he used to eat. And my, his mom made them for him and then my mom made them for him. And now I make them for him. Um, they're an oatmeal based cookie and um, my husband, Matt, does not like dates. So one year, because my mom is the type of person that she is and um, always wanted to please everyone, and Matt is a huge cookie fan, especially a huge oatmeal fan, she decided why don't we try a different kind of filling. So ever since then, we've been making both date filling and a raspberry filling, pleasing everyone. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna let that filling cool off and in the meantime, start on to the next recipe. This is a old family favorite recipe, some bourbon balls. Most important ingredient, of course, bourbon. bourbon to taste. My aunt used to always say more bourbon is better. So Tastes good. Tastes good. Well, the, uh, we just got a delivery here and <laughs> good news and bad news. Good news is um, we think we have new pots and pans. The bad news is that they may be in 35 pieces. <laughs> We're going to find out here. 
how they look. They're not broken, good news. Okay, it's official. We have finally upgraded our appliances. Phew, I thought she was gonna say me. <laughs> new coffee pot and new pots and pans. Guess we're keeping him around. I'm still an original. <laughs> okay, enough of that funny business. Time to get serious. Back to bacon here. Back to these date filled slash raspberry filled cookies. I've stolen the camera. Welcome to Matt and Stacy's cooking channel. We have Stacy manning the uh, chorizo sausage over there. We saw, we showed you earlier, we got new pots and pans. So what better way to get rid of the old ones than to just use them all in one dinner. So we're gonna attempt to use most of these to cook. Meanwhile, we've got some fresh bread bacon over there. Definitely have the beer ready from Hoppin' Frog. We've got uh, some, some veg veggies diced up broth left over from some seafood boils that we froze a while ago. Chorizo sausage. Some raw shrimp that'll go in eventually. And then of course you got your rice, your smoked paprika, Spanish saffron, and ground turmeric. All to be used to make what? I think it's called Spanish, well I know it's Spanish. Paella, maybe? I'm not pronouncing that right. I don't mean to butcher anybody's language, but I think it's Spanish paella. Okay, sounds good to me. Sounds like it's gonna be, mmm, la la, good. I don't think that's Spanish. Well, probably not, but it's gonna be good. Muy bien. I don't know if that's Spanish See. either. Okay, cut. I do truly apologize if we have butchered anybody's native language or language. Um, dinner does look delicious and I will leave a link in the description box below of the recipe that we kind of based this off of. <laughs> Thanks for coming along today. We really appreciate it. If you guys liked it, you know what to do. Thumbs up. We will see you tomorrow for more Vlogmas fun. Yay! But now it's time to eat. Dinner time. Bye. Bye for now.